rock group called the JY, like in like '96, called the Junkyard, and we did some stuff with that. I never got released, and there's some time and stuff. And that's the only time I ever, I've ever gotten vulgar okay. on my records. But I mean, that's hip hop, you know. That was just my vision for those songs, right. and that's which I, which is why I don't really, you know, say anything bad about these rappers. I don't really care what you talk about. You can talk about chopping somebody in eight pieces, mm -hmm. but I, I, I prefer you do it in a poetical sense. Uh, Instead yeah. of shout out, chop the head off, shout out, chop the head off. You know what I'm saying? I hate that. Yeah, you know somebody gonna probably write that now, right? Shout out, chop the head off. You can hide that one too. Man. But I mean, like something, something like really, like one record that really pissed me off, and mm -hmm. I forgot the name of Google. They talk about uh, I'm a Brian Nichols, and they was playing on the radio. And I'm like, remember that song? I forgot what it was a rap song. I'm a Brian, Brian Nichols. Nichols. And it was, you know, and I'm saying, just thinking of the, of the symbolic meaning of what they were saying. Yeah. To me, I thought that was so disrespectful wow. to the families and everybody that got murdered during that time. Right, right. And I'm right. saying, you know, I'm like, damn, if they play that, they won't play my records on the radio. Mm. And I'm talking about something that that really means something to people. I'm talking about life, love, and relationships, which is from the person to the hardest hard rock to the soft of the softest go through. You got to go through life, you got to go through love, and you got to go through relationships, whether it's sexual, whether it's physical, spiritual, Absolutely. financial, whatever it is, you got to go through relationships. And that's all I talk about in my music. And that I Need It song is a real life situation. I guarantee you, for any anything I write, <laughs> I can't say that's my story, but right. I know I know whose story it is. And, and one thing I learned from my uncle is to observe and just watch things around me. And all of my songs, like I got a song that I, I was going to release, but I'm not because the sample clearance is called Killer Man. It was mm. about a friend of mine who found out that one of our dudes was sleeping with his wife. Oh, man. And I'm just telling a story. I took off early. I had this whole day planned out. Boom, boom, boom. And I had everything set up so it would be sweet. Yeah. Uh-oh, I'm home. What the hell is this? Somebody in my house. Somebody been drinking my Hennessy. My wife don't oh, even drink. Man. What's going on? It's a whole story. I'll let you get that one. You probably got that. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. I'm going to offer that as a free download. Okay. And, um, but I mean, the I Needed song, my daughter's singing that too. And I, I, I found out <laughs> in my tour of Ohio and in, in Dallas, I did Dallas. Um, also, I'll be on a Tom Jordan and Studio Jams in the next couple of weeks. Okay. <laughs> I Need It, it's like, you know, so many talk bad, so many people talk bad about sneaking around and cheating. Yeah. I'm saying that's what everybody doing. And when I sing that song every <laughs> night, Man, you had some hot stuff, but I need it, John Dog. Oh, man, I need, <laughs> I need it, John Dog. I need it, I need it. 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 It's, it's stuff like that going on, and it's about two people that have been friends forever, like each other, never say nothing about it, yeah. and they hook up years later, and they hit it off, but both of them is married. Wow, that happens. It, it totally it happens. When can they get this album? <laughs> the album will be available May 26th, and I, I'll just be thinking, that's your birthday, you not? No. Oh, great. <laughs> May 26, 2009, I'm, I'm not pressing any up, I'm doing it on Line only. Line. Line. iTunes, Rhapsody, Yahoo Music, C D Baby, Amazon. Not not Limewire and Bear Share though. Okay. You know, wait wait a year, then you can go download it for free. Wow. Uh, I need to check that right year. Now. Request me in your city. I'll perform at a birthday party, a bar mitzvah, a cantata, a circumcision, uh <laughs> a get -top ball, whatever it is. And I'm saying it, no place is too big or too small for me and no person is too old or too young for me. How about that? How can they contact <laughs> They can contact me at uh Tolly Hustle, that's T as in Tom O L L I E Hustle, H U S T L E, I don't do Ebonics at gmail.com. Like all my songs. You won't see that. Like I got a song called "Trying to Get It In." Yeah. The, my dude, 314, that produced it, he had put T R Y I N T O G E T T I N. I'm no T R Y I N G mm. T R Y I N G T O G E T right. N. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't do the bars. I don't do those. But um, yeah, May 26 online only. It's called Black Pavarotti, B-L-A-Q-P-A-V-A-R-O-T-T-I.